going to do the furry friend tag because this week is my furry friend's birthday and he's not cooperating. But here we go. Anyway. Okay, my pet friend's name is Snuffles. Well, Snuffle up, I guess, but Snuffles for short. And we mostly call him Snuffles because I'm allergic to him. <laughs> so he gives me the Snuffles. Hi, baby. Hi. Hello. Yeah, you want me to put you down, but it ain't happening. Anyway, I have had him a little under a year. Got him at the end of September in 2013. But it's his birthday this week. Woohoo! Okay, anyway, how did I get him? Oh, he's a cat. He's a cat. What breed is he? He's a cat. He has a domestic short hair stray. <laughs> Who's very mad. Little mad. He wants to go play outside. Okay, anyway. <laughs> anyway, how did I get him? Well, funny story. Well, I find it funny. Last September, I got a text message from my best friend, and he said, My sister has kittens. Come see them. And I said, oh, Kittens! I'll be right there! And I went up there, and they told me how they had found the kittens. There was a box of kittens that she had. And she said she had graduated from high school, but she had still been helping out with an art club on some evenings of the week and so she had gone to the local high school and they were making pottery that night so they went into the kiln to put the pieces away and get ready for firing and they heard meowing and so oh stay put look look at the camera look at the camera look at it Anyway, they heard meowing, and so they went and they found a litter of kittens that were about six weeks old. And so some of the kids from the high school took some of the kittens with them, and it turns out that there were two that didn't have a home yet. There was a black one, and Mr. Munchkin here. And so my friend's parents... Well, my friend's dad is deathly allergic to cats. He just, he can't have them in the house. Or he goes, or he can't breathe. Anyway, so I said that I would take both cats for the night. And the next day, they found a cat, a home for the black cat, Snuffles' brother. And still no home for Snuffles, and I really wanted to keep him. But my mom said no, because my sister's allergic, but she doesn't live here anymore. She's only here to visit every six months or so and then never for more than two weeks so i thought well i really want the cat i want to keep it so my brother and my younger brother and i just kept talking to my mom i just kept talking to her until she finally agreed that we could keep him and so she took him that that week actually they were having the free spay neuter clinic so she took him to that and when she came home from that she said okay you can keep him he's just so cute <laughs> so that's how i got my cat and i've loved him so much ever since how old is he he is a year this week and that's why i'm doing this to celebrate his birthday because I love him, and I just, I don't know what I would do without him. Some of his quirks, as he stalks my toes. <laughs> Some of his quirks are, he likes to, oh gee, I don't know, most things he does are very cat-like and normal. Um, he likes to dive bomb your face when you're sleeping like he'll just come up and he'll this will this is his head and he'll be like meow, meow. and then he'll curl up on my chest because he's he's done that ever since he was a baby he curls up on my chest and that's where he likes to sleep when he's cuddly which is about five o'clock in the morning every day and that's the only time <laughs> so that that's that's his main quirk he has some other ones like, if you pet right between his shoulder blades, 
if you scratch there, not really pet, but scratch there, he will start purring anywhere between one minute and three minutes after you start scratching there. <laughs> and then keep purring until you stop scratching. So those are really the only two quirks I can think of off the top of my head. Well, what does my relationship mean? He's everything to me. I adore him. He's my best friend. Other, my best not human friend. I, I have a best friend. If he's watching this, I love you, John. You're, I love you more than the cat. I promise. I, I promise I love you more than the cat. However, Snuffles is the next best thing in my life. <laughs> I have no idea what I would do without him. He's mad. He wants to go play. <laughs> my favorite pastime to do with my cat, Snuggle, without doubt. I, I love snuggling with him. And I love petting his shoulders and hearing him purr. Um, I'll stick my toes under the bathroom door because there's quite a gap between the bathroom door and the floor. So I'll stick my toes under the bathroom door and let him chase them. But that's fun. Nicknames for my kitty... Turd, turd face, pumpkin, nuffle up nuffle butt, nuffles, meow meow. Yeah, meow meow, meow, meow. <laughs> uh, I think that's most of them. Basically, whatever I feel like saying at the time, darling, sweetie pie, cutie butt. <laughs> and that's it. So, happy birthday, Snuffles! Say bye, Snuffles. Meow! Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Bye!